So after surgery, when can you shower? Well, before I answer too much of this, I would definitely say check in with your surgeon because there are some differences of, of opinions on, on what can be done and when. But in my practice, uh, let's say for a, uh, a double incision top surgery, which might be kind of the most fragile post-operative uh, recovery, uh, patients can by and large shower immediately after the first visit after surgery. The first visit's usually around one week after surgery. And then at that point, uh, patients can shower, the water can hit their head, it can even run over the nipple grafts. Um, but we don't have the shower directly hitting the nipple grafts until two weeks after surgery. Um, also at two weeks, a patient can gently create a little bit of lather in their hands and in a very gentle way, lather the chest, including the graft, but without any physical shear force on the grafts, which could still damage it at that time. Fortunately, three weeks after surgery, things are quite resilient. You can lather as you would in any other circumstance, and uh, the nipple grafts are very unlikely to be damaged uh, at that time um, by a regular shower. With regards to other incision types that don't involve skin grafts, pretty much the same story except that you can lather almost immediately. So that first visit is usually seven days after surgery even for those other techniques and then it, you can generally speaking just soap and cleanse yourself as, as you would gently but as thoroughly as you would be accustomed to um, with showers after that point.